we need to find the variance of the numbers 8, 21, 34, 47 and so on. Last number is 320. We can say that they are in arithmetic progression with a common difference 13. The last term is 320 and the first term is 8. So it's a general term a n is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d. So if I consider the last term 320 is equal to 8 plus n minus 1 into 13. So we can write 320 is equal to 8 plus 13 n minus 13 that is 325 is equal to 13 n. So we can write n is equal to 25. So we got the number of terms is 25. And the general term can also be written as a n is equal to 8 plus n minus 1 into 13. Or we can write 8 minus 13 is minus 5. So 13 n minus 5. Now to calculate the mean, sum of these numbers, observations, that is sum of 25 numbers, which is equal to 25 by 2. We know that Sn is equal to n by 2 into a plus l, first term plus last term. So here first term is 8 and last term is 320. So we can write 325 into 328 divided by 2, that is 164. 25 into 164 is the sum of the numbers. And to get the mean, so we have to write mean is equal to sum of the observations by the number of observations which is equal to 25 into 164 divided by 25 so you are getting 164 so this is mean now to calculate the variance we need summation x square that is 8 square plus 21 square plus 34 square and so on up to 320 square so which is nothing but summation of its nth term is 13 minus 13 and minus 5. So we can have 13 and minus 5 whole square which is equal to 169 n square and here minus 130 n plus 25 summation which is equal to 169 times summation n square minus 130 times summation n plus 25 times summation 1 that is 169 into summation n square is n into n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 divided by 6 minus 130 times summation n is n into n plus 1 by 2 plus 25 times summation 1 is nothing but up to 25 numbers are there so we can write 25 into 25 that is summation n we can write. Summation 1 is nothing but n. So let me write n here. Now let us substitute n is equal to 25. n is equal to 25. We have 169 into 25 into 26 into 51 divided by 6 minus 130 into 25 into 26 by 2 plus 25 into 25. So we can take 25 common. So we can write here 2 13 times and 3 times and 3 17 times. So 169 into 13 into 17 minus here 130 into 13 plus 25. Upon calculation, you will get the value 35,684. This is summation xi square. Now the variance formula is summation xi square divided by n minus mean square. So which is equal to 25 into 
35,684 divided by 25 minus 164 mean is 164 whole square. So we can get 35,684 minus 164 square value is 26,896. So after calculation, you will get 8,788. So we can say that 8788 is the variance.